when setting out to design the next generation of RPM, we focused and put a lot of emphasis on versatility. We were really fueled by insights from our customers, as well as elite and masterful pro kiteboarders in all disciplines. These learnings really set us down a new development path, which really created an entirely different breed of performance free ride versatility in a kiteboarding kite. And we've aptly named that kite the RPX V1. We started with Tony's design, which is, was already an outstanding freestyle kite. And we wanted to bring it a little bit more towards like a free ride platform. We started with the panel layout. Panel layout from before was meant to be very strong. Uh, now we wanted to make it ultra minimalist. So we actually reduced the panel account by 88 pieces of panel, which made the kite a lot more dynamic in the air and uh, it made also the kite lighter. We wanted to use DCP 400 bridle, which is a bridle very thin. It's about 25% thinner than regular bridle and it's extremely static. There's almost no stretch in it. The kite response is way more snappier and quicker, which is very important for free ride. Along with the reduced weight, we completely redesigned the trailing edge. This eliminated areas of turbulence, drag, and flutter. This created a more efficient canopy that resulted in next level performance out of the kite, meaning faster, more responsive turning, better recovery after kite loops, giving you more confidence and performance for anything from big air to foiling and beyond. The Open C was basically developed off of keeping the hoop of a C kite and chopping the tips and making it more compact. And this is what Open C really does is it keeps the kite from pivoting too quick. The nice thing about a kite that's not too pivoty is it gives a nice constant pull through the turn and in a loop the biggest part is like not having a big spike like a pivot and a spike because that will slack your lines and you'll stall the kite as you get spiked towards the kite. The concept hasn't changed. People still want a certain amount of range. They want a comfort feel and they also want an intuitive kite that's easy to fly and that's what the RPX does. It's a more dynamic kite than an RPM. The RPX is built with our 4x4 canopy material. This is the most durable and stiffest, also the strongest ripstop material available. We really settled in on that to make sure that we were giving our customers the most value out of the actual kite. So this kite can withstand basically anything and everything that you can throw at it. Um, that means that all disciplines you're gonna be covered with this really durable ripstop. It's also extremely stable in gusty conditions, so it really makes for a, just a stronger, better kite platform. The RPX features another slingshot invention, and that's split strut. We, we implemented the split strut construction, which is where a strut, rather than dangling off of the canopy, is actually integrated directly into the canopy, and it's stitched on two sides. This provides just a way more stable airframe and cleaner airflow over the top of the kite. And we're really proud to offer it on the RPX because it makes it stronger, stiffer, and just more stable for all condition use. The RPX features another slingshot invention, One Pump. This patented technology is now used industry-wide and has received an upgrade. We have enlarged the tube diameters of the hoses for cleaner airflow, as well as repositioned the tubes to make them more streamlined and closer to the kite for better airflow and more structural stability.